This is a press statement by the ODM County Chairpersons. With the ODM Party County Chairpersons, drawn from the 47 counties under the auspices of the County Coordinating Committee Chairpersons Caucus, that is COCC, have met here today in our quarterly meetings and resolve as follows. One, we support the initiatives of our party leader, His Excellency Raila Odinga, in uniting the country under the banner of Asimio Laomoja. We have resolved to, to devolve this unity message to the lower units in our respective counties. As the county party leaders, we have released His Excellency Odinga to move across the country and seek votes from all Kenyans. We commend the National Elections Board's performance in the just concluded party grassroots harmonization process that was effectively conducted despite the challenges occasioned by the COVID-19. <laughs> Further, as the COC, we are satisfied with the progress made by the National Elections Board with the systems and frameworks put in place in readiness for the party primaries. We have resolved to offer the NAB our unreserved support as they embark on this daunting task. We urge our members to wait for the NAB's communication and direction on the modalities of conducting the party primaries. Four, as county party leaders, we have been tasked with the identification of aspirants in all electoral areas in our respective counties and shall aim to have ODM candidates for all seats from governor to MCA. Fifth, in the ongoing enhanced voter registration drive, we urge our supporters to take IDs and register as voters in large numbers. As a county, Chairs, we have resolved to take the lead in this process in our counties. Sixth, as leaders drawn from all corners of the country, we condemn in the strongest terms the emergence of insightful and hateful messages like Madoadoa by our opponents. We urge all leaders to employ language that promotes the peace and unity. We further advise our supporters to look out, ignore statements and actions by our increasingly desperate opponents aimed at provoking them into actions that paint our party and our leader in bad light. We want to ask all Kenyans to maintain peace and brotherliness during and after the election period. Dated this in, uh, at Nairobi this 20th day of January 2022.